Hello there, boys and girls of the Minecraft universe. Centronet here with episode number one of take two of Four Pillars Survival here on good old Bedrock Edition. And ladies and gentlemen, I'd like to introduce you to the brand new Four Pillar map. Check it out. As you can see, we've got our Four Pillars around us. Not much new there, but there's a whole bunch of new stuff in each one of these pillars. We are going to stay true to the origins of this game. So a lot of the stuff that you guys saw last season is still there. But we have some new things that we've added to, and there are also some new challenges that I want to introduce this season. Uh, one of the first things you guys might notice is the middle island is a little bit different. It's more in line with the classic map. But we are in episode number one, which means that we got to start with the grindy, grindy, grindy stuff. So let's see if we can't get a tree growing to start. That would be absolutely awesome. I want to move the forge. I want my first tree to be there. Whoo! Thought we were going to use all the bone meal on the first one. I still want to try and get some seeds. It'd be really good. I always forget about that. I'm trying to get the farm going first because we're going to need food. All right, come on. Let's see if we're lucky with this tree. We need to get at least one more sapling or else this is going to be the shortest season of Four Pillar Survival ever. <laughs> How's everybody doing today? I am doing absolutely fantastic. I'm really excited to get this series kicked off. You guys know that I love playing in the sky, and after what happened with uh, Sky Factory, I was ready to start over and get something new going. And this is still by far my favorite sky map. Let's see, are we going to be lucky? Are we going to get any saplings? I want some saplings. Did you guys notice my head is floating? <laughs> We're going to step up our game this year, so not only will I be doing face cam for the episodes and for some other things that I planned on the channel, uh, we're going to be doing a green screen. I got a green screen. Woohoo! I got some feedback you guys didn't like looking at my printer in the background. <laughs> and some of the other ones that we've done. So, yeah, we're going to skip the uh, showing of the printer and we're just going to see my floating head. Excuse me for one moment. I'm thirsty. Got some coffee going this morning. Mmm. Of course, in my creeper coffee cup. Now, let's see if we can be lucky and get a seed. We were lucky and we... Oh, we got a seed. Cool. Oh, so this episode isn't going to be one of the terribly exciting ones, but I'm really looking forward to starting new. As you guys know, Skyblock, we have to do the grindy bit first. We've got a seed. I want to move my tree and put my tree here. Let's see if we can't get the workings of a cobblestone generator going. We've got to get planks first. Let's go ahead and make some sticks because I always forget about those. Get a crafting table. See if we can't get a little setup going here. I don't want to do it on the tree side. Let's do it over here. Break our first block. Woohoo! We are off and running. Is that going to give me enough space though? Boom, boom. Nope, that won't give me enough space. So I broke a block for nothing. How's that for a great start? Now we just need to make sure that we don't create obsidian. <laughs> It really is the scariest part because I tend to forget how to do this the first time. See, our water is going to go where I'm standing. It's going to flow down there. That's going to be where we chop, and this is going to be where our lava goes, right? Did I do that math correctly? Let's go ahead. Let's check. Boom. And then boom, and let's... Oh, come on. Woo-hoo! All right, and there's a dirt block that we can really break for real and be excited and happy about it. So I'm going to throw my bucket in there just in case I do dumb stuff like dying. Um, If I put a torch on there, would that prevent the fire from spreading? Oh, I doubt it. I'll stick the torch here for now. We're not going to need that much light because we got the lava source going. Let's go ahead and get a pick. We are off to the races. How do you like that? Uh, you know what else I'm going to make? You guys might think I'm crazy, think it's way too early to be doing this kind of stuff, but I want to not make some of the mistakes that I made last time with waiting too long to do some of this. I also want to save the dirt. There's no reason to expand the island just yet. I would rather do that with cobble. Let's go ahead and get our first piece of cobble on the server. Server? On the series. Woohoo! Yes, I do drink coffee. 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 I think I said copy the first time. I do drink coffee from a creeper coffee. I don't know. Just one of those things. Hmm. Alright, so as you can see, we're doing the exciting day one groundy bit. Uh, 
I uh, wonder, we'll probably go for... I can collect it, thank you. I want to get enough to get a floor going under this thing. But I also don't want to bore you guys too much, because I want to try a new trick. See if I can't get below this thing a better way than we did in the past. We did the whole floating water thing last time, and yeah, I don't... I don't want to dangle off the edge too much this go around. I want to make sure that I'm being as cautious and careful as possible. We're going to do this whole thing without dying. <laughs> yeah, right. So this is a brand new map. I did do a fresh port of the original map over to Bedrock. And then I went through the achievement list to see you know, how we did last time. See what kind of things I could change, what kind of things I could add based on some of your feedback down in the comments. And... I added some new things. I took a couple of things away, but nothing that's really going to impact the game in any crazy way. How do I want to do this? I'm going to just try this like this and see if this actually works. What if I put lava there? Will they touch and build me a pillar? I don't think they will. They won't. What if we did this? I took a piece of cobble and I put it right uh, here. It's gonna drop a pillar down there. Let's see. Ready? In theory, these two should get buddy buddy. Yes, and it should make cobble, and this should flow all the way down. Woohoo! <laughs> I was nervous to try that because. Uh, when I was doing some of my testing of the world, I thought I was a hotshot and I made obsidian. Uh, so I'm just glad that I didn't make any obsidian this time. Uh, does that not let them touch, though? That puts them too far away. What if we did... I'm gonna ruin this. Um... All right, so here's what I'll do. I'm, I'm just gonna be overly cautious. Sorry guys, I don't want to lose on the first day. What I'm curious about is if I do that. I think that's gonna turn that into obsidian. What's it doing? Guys, I'm confused. Why isn't this working? Yep, we're off to a great start, aren't we? Uh... Uh... Hmm. Alright, what if we put that there, and we take this from here, and we put it right... Is that doing it? That's doing it! <laughs> It's a victory. We'll just take it for what it is for the first day. Oh, man. That's hilarious. All right. So that's going to build us a pillar going all the way down to the bottom. We should probably get a couple more of those going at some point. But I'm going to have to watch the footage back to know how I did it because I really have no idea. Let's get some more cobble. So the idea here is we're going to have that pillar that will let us go all the way down as low as we want to go because that should build cobblestone going all the way down. And then it's also going to let us get under the island to be able to get that other chest and hopefully catch all of the dirt without losing any of it or the grass so that we can make the platform in the middle just a little bit bigger because I need more space to roam around so we can get more trees going. That was really funny. I still have no idea how that worked. Uh, it feels like the sun's starting to go down. We'll be perfectly safe here. Now, one thing I didn't check. Uh, did I sleep? Uh, phantoms are a thing, so we do have to worry about that. Uh, we'll see how that goes. <laughs> Get some more cobble. What's our tree doing? Any tree action? No tree action. The tree probably doesn't like me being right next to it. It doesn't want to grow because it's being shy. But once this pick runs out, we'll be able to get a stone or a cobblestone pick. We're going to be able to do this just a little bit faster. And I want to get... I need more wood because I'm going to need ladders to be able to come up and down once we 
drop down a bit under the island. Kind of my main goal for today, just expand just a little bit, get stuff in the chest that we have available to us, and see if we can't get some more trees go growing. I am troubled by the fact that I only got one sapling from that first tree. Does that remind anybody of last season? Oh man. I had tears on my face from laughing so hard about the lava and uh, water cobblestone pillar fiasco. <laughs> Oh, man. As you can see, it's going to be the same shenanigans. This time, you guys get to see the look on my face this time when I make massive amounts of mistakes. Not bad. We've already almost obtained a stack of uh, cobblestone, which is awesome. We're actually off to a really good start. We have sticks in here. We have no sticks in there because I know. All right, for now, I think I'll only make one... Then, how many more sticks can we We need, what, nine of them for ladders, right? We could do, and then we get three? Only get three. Right, that's going to have to work for now because we have a massive wood shortage. And let's make sure... All right, I think that's going to be good. Let's go over here and look and see what this actually did. It did actually make the pillar all the way down. I like it. I like it a lot. All right, we need to get under the island. I need you guys to listen for phantoms because I don't know if they're going to come or not, but let's see if we can't do this. I probably don't have enough cobble to be able to build the platform as big as I want to. All right, let's do some math first. So the obsidian is there. That's our chest. So from there, I want to come down one, two... Alright, so there's one, two, I think that's what I want to do, but let me look. So, f Ooh, ah, ah, math on camera. So there's that, and that, and then, uh, want it to be there? I need to get this right. I don't get a whole lot of chances to, uh, yeah, we wanted to come down one more. I'm, because I'm going to use that block. This time I'm going to use it instead of just having it sit there. So bear with me. i got to do some math. And you guys are watching me do math. I'm not good at math. One, two. And then I actually want the floor to be there. All right. So we came down one too far. Let's not fall. And I collected that cobble. How do you like that? All right. Did I do this right? I did this right. All right. We are good. Let's go ahead and get a little itty bitty platform going down here. I should have grabbed that torch. We're probably too close for anything to spawn. But a smart person would have grabbed the light source on the way down instead of waiting. Oops, that cobble in the wrong place, but we should be able to pick it up later. But how do you like this? Doesn't that work so much better than being or just uh, doing the whole water flow thing, which was really scary last time? Uh, if I remember correctly, we almost died doing it. All right. How am I going to get that other one in there? I can get the other one in there from here. I just don't want to lose the stuff in the chest, because we really don't have a choice except to break it. Alright, everybody, fingers crossed. I think I made it big enough. I did. what I get? Ooh, I got some string. I got end portal frames. I got mushrooms. Ocelots and cats. Nice. Alright, where is our way back up here? I need to not lose where that pillar is. We don't have enough ladders to get all the way up there, do we? I don't know. We're going to give it our best shot. Uh, okay. Come on. I don't like the whole dangling over the edge thing, but this is going to have to be what we do for now. So I'm going to go ahead and steal this torch because we have lava up here, which will give enough light to be able to grow and then keep bad guys away. All right, where's our center? Is that our center? That is our center. How do you like that? First try. Nice. We expanded the base. I want to... Well, we don't have any wood. I want to get a furnace going. We don't have anything to cook. I don't know. We're going to have to work on moving the dirt down there, but I really can't do a whole lot. I get the cobblestone generator moved. I don't want to move it yet because we don't have any other light up here. 
and I don't have enough cobblestone to do so. <laughs> Let's go ahead and get some more cobble. Come on, tree, grow! Always so slow in the beginning. But I am looking forward to kicking this off. It's going to be a blast. Uh, I will be sharing the map. There will be a world download. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to wait until episode number five. And then I'll go ahead and publish it so that you guys don't get too far ahead of me and tell me everything that's going on. Because I had help from very small people with hiding the stuff in the chest. Uh, the stuff that we added after last year. So it's going to be fun. I'm just excited to be doing this again grinding away in the sky and I have too much good stuff in my inventory that I need to get rid of I should be safe here but uh, I don't know it's me I will probably figure out a way to die oh man the grindy bits what was that noise Did you guys hear that I'm hoping it's too early for phantoms, but I thought I heard a phantom. Where's our tree? Will you grow already? Ah. Well, I will consider this a successful first episode. We didn't make obsidian, which is really, really, really good. We didn't die, which is even better. We were able to get a platform under us safely using an awesome technique to create a pillar of cobblestone all the way down. I have no idea how I did it. I'm going to have to re watch the footage. So we've kicked off episode number one of Take Two of Four Pillar Survival here on the channel. I know it's been grindy and probably not too exciting, but it's really, really, really good to be back. Um, in between episodes, I'm going to do nothing this time. Let's uh, do this in real time. And let's see how much stuff we can collect just in the grindiness in the beginning. I want to get trees growing. I want to get the grass downstairs. So that we're no longer up here in the sky. So we can have more. Up on the top level, rather. So that we can expand. I have more space to be able to play around. And we've got to get furnaces, burn eye, and all that good stuff going down there. And I want a better cobblestone generator. But we can't build hoppers. This thing is not lossless. But we are doing good. I've got more than a stack now. I love it. I hope you guys are excited that we're back. I am so excited to be back here playing Four Pillars. And I am looking forward to doing this. Let me know what you guys think of the face cam, the green screen, the map. Let me know what you guys think about the achievements. There is a list down in the description. It should be the final list I think that I'm going to go with. But if you guys have any other ideas, if there's anything that I'm not thinking about, let me know down in the comments. Guys, I'm so grateful and so appreciative that you guys have stuck it out with me. I'm very happy you guys are here to witness Take Two, Take Off. Take Two, Take Off? Hmm, that might be a little redundant. <laughs> Hope you guys enjoyed the grindy episode. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys liked the episode, make sure you hit that like button. If you guys loved it, make sure you subscribe. And this is Centronet, and I'm out.